Excitement in the Parisian air. We're at the Parc des Princes here in the French capital. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player, Stuart Robson. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. It's Paris Saint-Germain up against Real Sociedad. Well, this is what the Champions League is all about. Some of the world's best players, two excellent teams and a great stadium. Let's hope we're not disappointed. team looks like this Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper Lucas Hernandez plays with Ashraf Hakimi in the fullback positions Vitor Ferreira starts alongside Kangin Lee in central midfield and the main threat in attack today should be Kylian Mbappe And the starting 11 for Real Sociedad. Well, it's great to see both teams using wingers. It's now just a case of which team uses them best and which pair get the better crosses into the box. It should be a good watch. And the match begins. Lee. Well, they know they need to stop him. Oh, the threat is there. And his teammate got him out of trouble. Really being closed down. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Kubo. Well, considering the form book, Stuart, Kylian Mbappe has got to be taken seriously here. Yeah, he's a real handful, particularly when he's running with the ball. And, of course, his finishing has been so clinical. That's why he's their leading goal scorer. Precise ball movement. And quick thinking defensively. Mbappe oh beating his opponent with ease and using his strength to shield the ball oh a tremendous block Playing it short. Dembele. Marquinhos. Very... Mbappé! And there it is! The first goal in the semi-final! A huge moment! Extraordinary scenes! Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. has to get his team plan again this isn't going to plan so the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0 
Bryce Mendes. Subi Mendy. Mikel Marino. And moving the ball forward with genuine purpose here. Physically strong and secure on the ball. That's not a bad ball. Managed to get it out of there. Lee. Oh, he looks threatening. Angles it back. Just the challenge that was required. And the counter attack is on. Options available. Marino. Electing to shoot. Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Well, chasing the game, but now a corner. Who can he pick out? And knocked out of there. Subeldia. Subimendi. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Surely the equaliser. Oh, a stellar piece of defending. And so the half-time whistle has gone here at the Parc des Princes in Paris. Well, who wouldn't want to have Kylian Mbappe in their side? Stewart, a key component of his team. Into the second half here at the Parc des Princes. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Teammates in the middle. Well, at one point on its flight, I wondered if the keeper would have difficulties, but no problems at the end. Hakimi. Mbappe with it. Now, what can Paris Saint-Germain do from this position? Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Trying to really get at the opposition here. And play halted, free kick given. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Played in there. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Can he find the right pass? Nicely timed tackle. Lee. Vitor Ferreira. Marco Asensio. Well, he has the measure of his opponent. Mbappe. Well, unable to bend his run offside. Substitution it is for PSG.
Zubelia. It's with Mikel Marino. Oyar Sabal. Kubo. Oh, great vision. And forward they go, chasing the game. tell you what that is really top class defending that's what you call defending from the front possibilities here Hernandez there will be one minute added on at the end full time then and job done for PSG they will carry an advantage with them into the second leg well they'll be pleased with that victory but it's a slender lead they're taking into the second leg and I think they'll be confident but it's going to be tight that's for sure well choose your descriptive word where Kylian Mbappe is concerned explosive is one adjective you could use Stuart yeah, not much more you could ask for, really. Plenty of effort, a goal, and most importantly, the right result. He should be happy with